Country Fire Service volunteers say lives and homes could be at risk if the government's plan to merge the state's emergency services goes ahead. They've thrown their support behind their chief, fearing his position could be threatened despite masterminding the fight against the worst Adelaide Hills bushfire in decades. There's no doubt about the bravery and professionalism of South Australia's Country Fire Service. The past eight days in the Adelaide Hills proving just that. Very few loss of homes, no loss of life with an integrated management system. It was that very system which led to the quick response which saved more than 1,000 properties and the one CFS volunteers now say will be lost in the government's overhaul of the state's emergency services. There was a groundswell of people saying if they change this then we're not going to play. From July, the Metropolitan and Country Fire Service and the state's emergency service will be merged into one department. It's a move which has left the man in charge of protecting South Australian homes and lives this week in the dark. What's it mean for my job? Um, well, I'll be looking for a job. It's going backwards. We're not prepared to accept that, and neither is our chief, and he's got our support. When they merge things, you, you tend not to get the desired effect. If it's working, I suppose you don't need to change it. The government says the reforms will remove duplication between organisations, which will in turn bolster the resources available for frontline services. It also says all services will continue to have their own identities, so the incident management approach we witnessed during the past week will continue. Don't try and fix something that isn't broken. Samantha Vardis, Nine News.